Hi guys, in today's tutorial I'd like to show you how you can build yourself a ghost slime block player elevator that will launch you up 36 blocks into the sky. So if I enter this, you can see that there's a slime block underneath my feet, but this is just a ghost slime block. So after some time I will get launched up into the sky by 36 blocks, take uh, just a little bit of damage and then I'm up here to show you what you need to build this, which is just a few building blocks, then three non-movable blocks, two sticky pistons, one piston, three redstone torches, two repeater, five redstone dust, a trapdoor, and a cactus with a sand. So uh, this concept was not made by me and Skid who developed this, but uh, we wanted to make one that is extremely compact, extremely easy to set up for survival. So this is what we ended up with. It is just a footprint of three by five by five blocks. And so uh, it is extremely small and extremely user friendly. We also added this water source up here uh, to make it uh, so you don't take fall damage when you fall down from the top. And we added this uh, trapdoor here. So when the ghost slime block is not there when you're falling down, you can't fall through to the cactus then the trapdoor will just let you exit the thing. So let me quickly show you how you can set it up yourself because as I said, it's extremely simple. So you just set, uh, start with a non-movable block, put the um, pressure plate on top, then a redstone torch to the side and then we'll want to go down because we need a um, yeah short pulse. So we'll put a four tick repeater. So we end up with a always turned on signal which will turn off for three ticks when we enter the pressure plate. Then we just go over by one and put this already into the first sticky piston. And we also can bring the signal down underneath the sticky piston to power up this block, which will then, if I grab myself some redstone torches, um, also power the same sticky piston with two ticks delay just through the redstone torches. And uh, then we can take the signal from here, bring it into a redstone dust and another block to power our second sticky piston. Then down here, we want to place a repeater, which will power the slime block that will be sitting here. And on top of the slime block, there will be the uh, normal piston. This is the ghost block machine. If we just add uh, the second slime block over there, we can already create ghost blocks. As you can see, this block is not really here. If I now place a block on top, you can see that the block gets replaced. So it's not really there. And now we can just add a non-movable block there and a non-movable block uh, here because otherwise this block will be moved. Add the trapdoor here on the side and then you can grab yourself uh, some ice and uh, just put down the ice blocks uh, or the ice block one block above. So um, give this some light until it melts and uh, then you can just pillar up and uh, make your exit because this will already be working. I can quickly demonstrate this. So if I go to game mode zero and enter this, this ghost slime block will be underneath my feet, the trapdoor will close again, but I'm still standing on the slime block. So now I will get launched any second if I would have placed the cactus underneath, of course. So um, just go down. So the cactus is standing next to uh, underneath the block over here. So I hope that you enjoyed this tutorial. If you did, then feel free to leave a like, subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and share this video with your friends. And I hope then to see you in the next video. So until then, have a great day.